Thank you very much. Um, I too just want to say congratulations to all of you folks who are in the trenches doing such great work. Um, the charter school movement is alive, it's real, and it's stronger than ever. You have an all-star cast here. You got a chance to hear from the Terminator, Arnold Schwarzenegger, and see his commitment to, to education and charter schools. Um, I grew up in Sacramento in a poor neighborhood and uh, went to a public school. I thought I was a good student until I got to college. And I got to college and I realized I wasn't prepared. And that was a, a, an experience that was mind-boggling to me. And I made a commitment back then that I was always going to do my part to make sure kids in poor neighborhoods had access to high quality education and that's what you folks are doing. So personally, I'd just like to thank you on behalf of all the children that you serve and will continue to serve um, going forward. Um, thank you. So as a mayor of the city of Sacramento, um, prior to this I played basketball in one of my other lives and politics is even tougher just for those who Anyway, um, we ran charter schools, and we a couple charter schools here in Sacramento. Um, the high school that we run, Sacramento High School, last year had the biggest API jump of any high school with more than 500 students in the state of California, where 80% of those kids are now going on to four-year colleges. And that is very significant. <laughs> that is very significant because Prior to us taking over this school and running it as a charter school, only 20% of those kids were going on to four-year college. And we also have an elementary school, and we have a school in Harlem as well. But the elementary school, its API score is 873. And what ended up happening in the elementary school is 93% African-American, poor community, poor neighborhood. And you know this achievement gap that we talk about? The first couple years, this was the gap at that school. Then it became even, where there was no achievement a gap. And now there's a reverse achievement of gap. So, so what we're doing and what we're proving is that kids in any neighborhood can do equally as well or better than their counterparts if they have access to a high quality education. So as a mayor of this city, I do not believe we can have a great city without great schools. And that's my commitment. We want to be the leaders of education reform here in Sacramento and certainly what you folks are doing around the state. Governor Schwarzenegger went out on a limb to get behind the race to the top. Raise your hand if you're familiar with race to the top. Okay, everybody in the room is. So California came up short in terms of qualifying and receiving those dollars. However, the policies that are in place are going to make the environment that we all work in much better. And those children won regardless of the money because it was never about the money. It was about creating an environment where kids can do well, creating an environment where charter schools had the autonomy to do what you folks want to do, to create an environment with that autonomy comes accountability for results. And I am very thankful to the governor for leading that charge as well as the legislator and Speaker Bass and Daryl Steinberg. So can we give them a quick round of applause as well?